First Alert Weather with Madeline Parker is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. So we're looking nice and dry on First Alert Doppler Network this morning. We're not seeing any rain right now, but there is some chances for rain coming up in the forecast. But first, let's talk about the heat. It's going to be pretty warm and pretty humid today. We're going to be seeing a few clouds in the sky, which is going to bring down that heat impact a little bit in some areas, but we are going to be seeing a moderate impact over most of the heartland today. And that heat is going to be getting worse as we head into the weekend. So it's a good idea to keep a few things in mind. If you're going to be outside for a long period of time, make sure you drink plenty of water, wear loose light colored clothes so that you can help stay cool and try to take some breaks. Stay in the shade for whenever you can. Make sure that you're going inside, getting in the air conditioning when possible. Just take plenty of those breaks to prevent overheating. Another thing we're keeping in mind is that we are looking at a chance for some potential severe weather coming up on Sunday. We're looking at a level one out of five for severe weather. That's a marginal risk, mainly for some gusty winds and potentially some hail. It's going to be in this green area right here. It's coming in during the overnight hours of Saturday going into Sunday morning. Can be turning into showers by later morning. So make sure you have multiple ways of getting alerts when those storms roll through. Highs for today are going to be in the low 90s, but it's going to feel like it's in the upper 90s by this afternoon, thanks to all that humidity. Tomorrow morning, temperatures will be in the low 70s, so warming up quite a bit. This weekend, we'll be seeing those chances for showers on Sunday. It's going to get uh, pretty humid, so even though our temperatures are going to be in the low 90s, it's still going to feel like upper 90s by the afternoon. Looking at 96 on Monday, going to feel like it's in the triple digits on both Monday and Tuesday. The good news is, even though we'll be seeing another chance for storms on Tuesday and Wednesday morning, with that rain, we're going to start to see our temperatures getting a little bit lower down to the upper 80s on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, giving us a little bit of a break from all of that heat. 